What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Pisces, and you enjoy my content, if you can ring a little bell and buy my full top, I super duper appreciate you saying, saying, saying. This is um, hashtag glow up, but it's not a Pisces. If you want to be notified for future readings or you just clicked on the channel and you're interested um, in the channel, you can hit the notification button to be notified of future readings. <clears throat> this is for the sign of Pisces. This can resonate if you have Pisces in any aspects of your chart. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Midheaven, or Jupiter. Um, it's the hashtag glow up. It's the positive counterpart to um, um, the truth hidden. The truth hidden is the dark counterpart, the um, dark side, what they don't want you to know. Hashtag glow up is focusing on healing, growing, growth. A manifestation things of that nature so the light side counterpart of life so um just to let you guys know for the newbies just joining um this is a free general reading so it's very important only take the messages that resonate thanks everybody for all the love and support to the channel you guys have just been the best i appreciate every like subscribe um share unlike and every donation if you like to donate this high priest to five links in the description box below i appreciate all the uh every single donation single mom of two kids Okay, so we have healing, third eye chakra, sometimes life stings, flow like water, April and pen. Number 18, 64, 24, uh, or 24 might be very significant. You have 24 double deuces, so I think 24 is extremely significant. And 18 and 64, those could be significant ages of you or somebody you're connected to. It could be a possible jersey number. It could be a lottery number, possible lottery number. It could be a possible birthday number, date of birth number, green card number, social security number. Um, any kind of significant number, reoccurring number you're seeing on billboards or advertisements. 1864 or 24 double deuces. Healing. A particular Pisces is about to really start focusing on their healing. They have been through a lot especially the past couple years okay so you plug it in if this resonates with you heard a particular pisces has uh, really gonna start focusing on their healing Heard they've been through a lot the last couple of years so we have the healing card so um if this resonates with you you've been through a lot especially the last couple years it sounds like it's been down down trot after down trot after down trot um, and you're about to really start focusing on yourself, growing, healing, and manifesting yourself, um, healing from any past traumas or wounds or anything of that nature. Um, maybe for some, I feel you're going to do some shadow work and, um, really hopefully focus on treating others, um, in a proper way, because, you know, you can't, um, you can't treat others in a positive way until you love yourself. Um, you, I mean, you can't love others until you love yourself first, um, if that helps anybody. And I'm just being serious about that. So, um, you know, just really focusing on healing yourself, growing and healing yourself, um, doing shadow work inside yourself, um, really, um, manifesting yourself. There's nothing wrong with that. While spirit, sometimes life stings. A Pisces is about to really have a bitch slap of reality soon. Oh my God. Whoa. Mm, I heard bitch slap of reality, man. I heard, oh my God. I heard bitch slap of reality. I heard a Pisces is about to have a bitch slap of reality soon. My goodness. Some you're about to find out 
your partner has cancer, some you're about to find out a family member has cancer, some fed energy coming, oh my God, some severe financial issues. Oh my God, this is, woo, holy crap. So you plug it in how it resonates. My God, that's a bitch slap reality if I've ever heard it. Oh my God. You plug it in how it resonates. So for some, you're going to find out your partner has cancer soon. Some, you're going to find out a family member has cancer soon. Some, the tax, it sounds like the taxing authorities are coming after you. And some uh, fed energy because of fraud. So you plug it in however that resonates. Oh my God. Yeah. Whoa. Holy moly. Oh my goodness. And some, you're about to learn of a death soon. It's going to really hurt you. And some you're going to learn of a death soon. It's going to really hurt you. And some you're going to learn of a death. It's really going to hurt you. And I'm sure it will hurt your heart. Absolutely. Who does? Yeah. And um, that's the healing energy as well, you guys. That's the healing energy as well. Definitely. I mean, that definitely, um, definitely constitutes some healing. Those are some rough, rough, rough things. We're in hashtag glow up, the light side of things. But, you know, there's positive and dark and everything. And this just happened to be in your glow up. But you've got the healing in your glow up too. So you're going to heal from all these things. Yes, these are hard. And some of these were in Pisces, True Sin and Two. I remember that. Um, yes, these are hard, hard things. But you can always heal. You can heal yourself. Heal your traumas. Heal yourself. Do the shadow work. Woo-wee, that's rough. And some you can be dealing with the air sign because this is air sign energy. I'm sorry, fire sign, fire sign. Um, you can be dealing with the fire sign, wasp or fire signs. Um, if you are, they could have Aries, Leo, or Sag, and their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or Feminine, name or Jupiter, if you are. Third eye chakra, I see the wisdom of my higher self and apply the wisdom in my life. A particular Pisces is about to really start focusing on meditation and opening their third eye chakra. Okay, so you plug it in how that resonates. Well, that's awesome, Pisces. I heard you're about to really start focusing on meditation and opening your third eye chakra. So, um, <clears throat> opening your third eye. Absolutely. Um, that's how my third eye started opening. For anybody who's been watching me a hot minute, um, anybody knows that knows um, that's how my third eye started opening so you're really gonna start focusing on med meditation I think so you could open your third eye so maybe you can get spirit messages possibly is what I'm thinking for some of you guys this is exactly what I'm thinking um, because you know opening your third eye is the door the door to spirit to spirit grants you the access whether to um, receive the messages or not it's up to spirit world whether they want to give it to you but you have to be open in the vessel to receive the spirit messages so if your third eye is not open you can't even be receptive to um basically allow the spirit world to grant you access or not so absolutely yeah and that would be the healing too that would be very smart especially if you're a reader for some of who you are readers um that that could be the healing energy as well really healing yourself really focusing on meditation and healing yourself and growing yourself so your third eye can open so you so if spirit world decides to grant you the blessing of having a getting clear audience or clairvoyant or clear sit um or psychic medium or um dreamscape messages you will be a vessel to to do so absolutely absolutely flow like water A particular Pisces is dealing with an air sign for some and a water sign for others. <clears throat> okay, I heard particular Pisces is dealing with an air sign for some and a water sign for others. Some both and some both. So air signs are Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Water signs are Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Um, and for some, you're dealing with both. 
They can have any of those in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, Earth, Moon, Venus, Jupiter, Jupiter charge. You plug it in, how it resonates. It would be smart to guard yourself from these people for right now. You think they're working with you, but they're really not. Okay. I heard it'd be smart to guard yourself from these people right now. Um, you think they're working with you, but they're really not. So you had the flow like water card. So I take that as the conversation flows. I think you might say too much to them is what I think. I think you display too much to them, the air sign or the water sign or both. Um, and I think they use it against you is exactly what I think. This is because I heard you display too much to them. They're basically using you, Pisces, if this resonates with you. I think they're basically using you. Your you are displaying too much to them. You're making it flow like water. I heard it'd be smart to hold back. Definitely smart to hold back. Okay, I heard definitely smart to hold back. For some, this could be in a relationship. Maybe you're giving too much in a relationship. For some, it could be in a friend situation and you're giving too much. Um, you plug it in, how it resonates, if that resonates for you. But it sounds like this air sign or this water sign or both are using the living crap out of you. That's exactly, uh, they're either using your money, time, or energy. One or all those things. If you feel this resonates with you. But I think you're flowing like water in this situation and you're giving too much to um, energy, time, or money succubuses. This is exactly what I think. April. April is going to be a very significant time in a Pisces life. Wedding for some. Okay. Heard April is going to be a very significant time in a Pisces life for some of you guys, a wedding. So you could be getting married or somebody connected to you could be getting married. Um, there's some kind of wedding energy in April that is significant in your life in some shape, form, or fashion. And a vacation for some. Planned vacation and a planned vacation for some. So and for some of you guys, a planned vacation is significant in April as well. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. For some of you guys, you, uh, your name might be April or somebody you're connected to might be named April, possibly for some of you guys. Pin, new job, career. For some Pisces, you will be looking for a new job around this time frame, planning on graduating. Okay, I heard for some of you guys, you'll be looking for a new job around this time frame. You'll be planning on graduating soon. So graduation is usually in May. Um, so I'm thinking you'll be looking for a new job or career in April because you will be graduating in May for some of you guys. That's exactly what I think. Um, whatever career field that is, whatever study, line of study you're graduating in, you plug it in however that resonates, if that resonates for you. Wonderwall. Wonderwall. That's what I just heard. Wonderwall. Wonderwall. That's a song by Oasis. Wonderwall. Wonderwall. And that's actually my favorite song, actually, ever. Wonderwall is by, by Oasis. Maybe some of you guys is, maybe one of you guys' favorite song is Wonderwall, or maybe you're listening to Wonderwall. It's by Oasis, um, if you've never heard it. 
it's it's my favorite song ever but i just heard wonderwall so i think one of you guys likes this song or you're listening to this song um or you have it on your playlist or something but some kind of um wonderwall energy i think you're listening to the song wonderwall by oasis is exactly what i'm thinking but you plug it in how it resonates let me see if i hear anything else A Leo is about to blow it up in a huge way. It's going to really irritate you. Know this. Okay. Heard a Leo is about to blow it up in a huge way. It's about to irritate you. Uh, know this. So you plug it in how it resonates. Apparently, you, there's a Leo in your life you don't like. Um, in some shape, form, or fashion, they could have Leo in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, and Hammer, Jupiter charts. But I heard they're about to blow it up. So you know, not physically blow something up. In this instance, it's blow it up as in a positive way. I heard you, it's going to really irritate you. So it's going to, um, it's going to irritate the hell out of you. Uh, you don't like this Leo in some shape, form, or fashion. I'll tell you that. Um, but it sounds like they're about to start doing well in, in some area. So you plug it in, however that resonates. I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices. I hope this helped. If you think anyone else could benefit from these messages, please share the videos on your social media. I'd appreciate it. Love you guys. Namaste.